Hi guys, welcome back to New You Fitness. In a recent video on Thermogenics, I said that I had a sweet chili recipe for you, and here it is. Right, this is a really simple recipe. It's only gonna take about 10, 15 minutes to do, and then a little bit more cooking time. And the ingredients you're gonna need are 100 grams of garlic, that's a whole garlic clove there, 100 grams of fresh ginger, you need to peel that. A, uh, 300 grams of hot chilies, and I've got different colours here and different strengths. Uh, a litre and a quarter of cider vinegar, very important that it's cider vinegar. And this is the bad bit, an entire kilogram of sugar. So these are my 300 grams of chilies. I've got different strengths here because I like mine quite strong. Uh, these are the strongest. I don't think they've got any particular names, and I've got a feeling the red are slightly hotter than the green, but I'm not 100% sure, because I remember they were both very hot. So basically, you're gonna take all of your chilies, all 300 grams, and you're gonna roughly chop them, not too rough though. They are gonna go in a blender, but um, you know, the smaller you chop them now, the easier it will be in the blender. So these are all my chilies, all nicely chopped up. They look lovely. Next is the ginger. I've started peeling this one already. The best way I've found to peel this is with a spoon. I know it sounds strange, but you just want to take the skin off. If you use a peeler, you're going to lose a lot of the ginger itself. And once that's done, you're going to chop it up. Really, let's go with the blender as well. So there's the ginger, all chopped up. And that's going to go in the bowl with the chilies. And the next thing on the list is going to be the garlic. So, here's one I prepared earlier. Kind of. So, with this, you're just going to peel each clove and finely chop it up. So, this is my 100 grams of garlic. So, this now goes in the pot with everything else. Now it's time to get your cider vinegar and head over to the blender. Right, so you've got all your ingredients from your bowl. That goes into the blender, or food processor, whatever you guys call it. You'll notice that I've left all the seeds in all the chilies, because I like it as hot as I can get it. And then with your cider vinegar, put in enough just so it starts to blend, but it is all gonna go in eventually. That should do. It goes on. Give it a whack. There we go. That looks about right. So next step, we're going to transfer it to a pan. And then you're going to pour all that in. And then the rest of this is going to go in as we're cooking. So this is what we're left with. We're going to pour that into this big pan. Don't forget to take the blade out. I've done that before. The rest of your cider vinegar. Then the naughty bit. A whole kilo of sugar. This is why it's sweet chilli. And one teaspoon of salt. So now what you're going to do is you're going to bring this to the boil and once it's boiling, take it down to a simmer for 30 to 40 minutes until it thickens up. Okay, so this is the stage we're at now. It's been simmering for about 30 minutes. As you can see, it's starting to thicken up. The longer you leave it to simmer, the thicker it will get. If you want it thicker, you can add some corn flour or just leave it to, to simmer a bit longer and obviously it's going to thicken up when it's cooling as well, so the, when it gets to room temperature or when you put it in the fridge, it's going to thicken up on its own there. So get it to the uh, consistency that you're after, and then take it off the heat and let it cool down. So guys, it's the next day. My sauce has cooled it down, and I've bottled it up. I've got, I think, enough for a, another bottle like this. Um, it's, you can't really see how thick that is there, can you? But it makes a great dipping sauce. It's great on rice, chicken, fish, 
uh, noodles, anything like that. Use it as a dipping sauce, cooking sauce, or just as a, a you know a sauce. If you're on any kind of bodybuilding diet or weight loss diet or anything like that, especially bodybuilders, chicken, fish, turkey, it can get really boring sometimes. So try this, jazz it up. You can make it as hot or as uh, not so hot as you like. Don't forget, um, if you've seen my other video about thermogenics, this has got obviously the chilies in it and the ginger, they're all thermogenics. So um, look up what thermogenics are if you don't know and thermogenesis in my other video. I hope you give it a go. Recipe is, uh, I'll put in the description below um, all the ingredients you need and the amounts. And um, if you wanna know how to make it again, just uh, buy the stuff, watch this video again. I hope you give it a go. Recipe is, uh, I'll put in the description below um, all the ingredients you need and the amounts. And um, if you wanna know how to make it again, just uh, buy the stuff, watch this video again. I hope you try it, it's great stuff. So um, stick it on some nachos or something.